Hi Leo, welcome here. It's your girl Sally, and this is going to be your energetic love reading. This is for Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. It is a collective energies. Political that applies to your situation and leave the rest for others. If you're new here, a special welcome to you on this channel. We heal and we grow together. If you want to join your family, please feel free to subscribe. If you would like a personal reading, personal guidance, information for that will be in the description box. All right, Leo, let's say spirit of truth, light, and wisdom. I welcome you here. For Leo, they are love reading. Energetic love reading for Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. Let's see. Thank you, spirit. You have the Ace of Pentacles. Energetic love reading for Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. You have the High Priestess. Energetic love reading for Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. You have the Temperance. Energetic love reading for Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. You have the Five of Wands. Energetic love reading for Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. You have the Nine of Sword. Energetic love reading for Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. You have the Five of Cups. Energetic love reading for Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. You have the Two of Wands. Energetic love reading for Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. You have the Seven of Wands. Energetic love reading for Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. The Emperor. Energetic love reading for Leos. The Three of Swords. Energetic love reading for Leos. The Queen of Cups. Energetic love reading for Leos. The Knight of Wands. What is the overall energy? Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. You have the King of Wands. All right, Leo. So you could be connecting to an Earth sign, Taurus, or Capricorn. We have Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, Water. We have Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, Fire, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, Air sign. So all signs are here. So your overall energy, you have the King of Wands coming to here. Leo. I see a lot of you here uh, standing in your power with the King of Wands energy coming to here. I don't feel like you're defending yourself here like you're beginning to realize that you deserve better than the way someone is treating you kind of protecting yourself being assertive here against someone like you're fighting back yeah i see leo a lot of you are fighting back this could also mean holding back your feelings and emotion like withdrawing your feelings pulling your feelings away from someone here i feel here but i see some of you are in that energy where you are assertive like you're no longer um taking beers from whomever you're connecting to like you you feel like um you're returning the energy like if the way they, the the energy they bring to you is the same energy you return to them i feel like this is the energy that a lot of you uh, I mean, with the uh, King of Wands, like whatever energy they bring to you is the same energy you reciprocate back to them, you return back to them. I cannot see a, a lot of you are in the defensive mode here, Leo. Kind of feeling like you're ready for whatever, like in that energy of I don't care coming through here. So we have the Ace of Pentacles and the Knight of Wands. So this could be new love coming in for some of you here. Okay. Uh, something new, something um, promising coming to you here strongly. We have the High Priestess, the Temperance, and the Five of Wands. So I see some of you are in a conflict with someone right now. I feel like you've blocked that person. And you're also looking forward to something new coming to you here. So we have the Five of Cups, the High Priestess, and the Three of Swords here. So this is um, saying to me that there is regret in regards to decisions someone in your life have made. In regards to you and the situation, they do regret that. I see worry on their mind as well. Coming through here, there is a sense of loss here. So with the Emperor here, the Three of Swords, Queen of Cups, Knight of Wands, 
Is it someone that still love with you? But trying really hard to control their feelings, their emotion, trying to put their feelings over on under control. This person is losing sleep over you, Leo. They are not sleeping well. They are not sleeping well. They are thinking about the situation. So there is potential of someone new here for you guys, Leo. You could meet this person in transit, I feel very strongly. Like on the go, could be taking a bus, taking a walk. I see you, you know, meeting someone. It's a promising situation here with the Ace of Pentacles. It looks promising. But then let's clarify to get more insight into the situation. Why is the overall energy here, the King of Wands? For my dear Leos. The energy to love really. Why is the King of Wands here? Energetic love reading from our dear Leo's. Why is the King of Wands here? You have here the death. Leo, why do I get this um, I don't care anymore um, energy from you? Like, you feel like what is the worst thing that can happen coming through here? Feeling like what's the worst thing that can happen in the situation coming through here? Leo, I see a lot of you becoming single here. Scorpio energy coming through here. You'll be becoming single. Like, this is the energy of giving up. You're giving up. You're not tolerating someone anymore. You're not tolerating their fears. You're kind of ready for whatever will happen or whatever will come out of the situation. If this is going to end, then so be it. That's the energy you're in. You're kind of ready here for whatever that will happen. If this is the end, so be it. You're so ready. I see that you're not babying anyone anymore. You don't care what will happen anymore. You're at that point where you don't care. If this is going to end, then let it end. Why is the Ace of Pentacles here coming through for my dear Leo's? We have the judgment. Yeah, I see an ending and a new beginning for a lot of you. So this is new love coming through here, Leo's. This is new love coming through here for you guys. But currently in your energy, there is so much uncertainty, fears, okay, surrounding the situation. Why is the high priestess here for my dear Leo? What's coming through? We have the king of pentacles here coming to clarify the high priestess. Leo, I feel some of you could intuitively feel an offer coming for you. You could intuitively feel that someone is coming towards you. Why is the temperance here? Energetic love reading from Adelos. We have the Wheel of Fortune. I see a shift happening here in your love path. Leo, there's going to be a shift happening. I feel a time of peace and quiet for you guys, Leo, in regards to love. Okay, I see faith bringing you romance. Faith will bring you romance. Why is the five of wands here for my dear Leo's? We have the six of wands. This is resolution of conflict from the five to the six. This is resolution of conflict. Why is the nine of sword here for my dear Leo's? You have the three of wands. Leo, I see some of you are as worried about the situation as whomever you're connected to is. The situation is bothering you and this person. It's not just this person, the both of you. Why is the Five of Cups here coming through from our dear Leo's energetic love reading? We have the Fourth Sword. Someone you are not talking to right now is in regret in regards to what happened in this relationship. So they are taking this time to heal and at the same time revisit whatever happened. There is a sense of regret and loss here or a feeling of loss here. Why is it two of ones here for my dear Leo's? Leo, I see some of you will be planning to reach out to someone. You're thinking of reaching out to them. You're thinking of taking some kind of action towards this person. Why is the seven of wands here for my dear Leo's? 
We have the four of wands. Leo. I feel like when it comes to your energy, there is some kind of ebb and flow here. We are one minute you feel like you're done, you don't care, and the next minute you still want to fight for this. You miss this person, whomever you're connecting to, you miss them, and you do love them. Why is the Emperor here coming to from my dear Leo's? We have the Six of Pentacles. So, Leo, yeah, someone is going back and forth with you and someone else, okay, in their mind, or it could be that this could be a third party situation. But I see them here going back and forth here. They are finding balance. They are finding balance. 4 plus 6 is 10. 10 is the number of ending and new beginning. They're kind of worried about something ending in their life. But if this ends, it's going to create an opportunity for new beginning for you and their life. It's a win-win situation here where they feel like in order to have this, they need to let this go. And they are not ready for that. This is a tough decision for this person. Some of you, this person could be your soulmate. Why is the Three of Swords here coming through from our dear Leo's? We have the Sun. Someone that broke your heart, Leo. Someone that broke your heart. For some of you, they will try to come put a smile on your face again. Okay? But there is that feeling of rejection here coming through here. Feeling like you might reject them. Why is the Queen of Cups here? Coming through from my dear Leo. We have a flower. Leo. So someone you're going to an ending with here. They are still in love with you. And I feel for some of you this feeling is mutual. Why is the knight of wands here for my dear Leo? We have the strength. Yeah, Leo, someone is coming towards you. You will find love. You will find romance. And also see someone from your past in your energy. Let's look a bit more into this new love. Holy Spirit, what's up with this new love? For my dear Leo's. The judgment, the ace of pentacles, the strength, and the knight of wands. What's up with this new love? Who is this person coming towards my dear Leo's? We have the page of pentacles. This person could be someone younger, or there could be an age difference with you and this person. This person could be an earth sign coming through here strongly. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. This is new love. This is new love coming through. For some of you, we have an air sign person here. That is married yes this sm person is married um i see that they will be presenting like an offer to you i see here they will be presenting an offer to you some of you i kind of feel like you will not accept this offer because it's coming off as though they see you as an option okay strongly here an sm person will make an offer to you present an offer to you but i see that you will not take it majority of you this air sign is married okay not all of you but majority this air sign person is married but i have a feeling that some of you will not take this offer because it makes you feel like an option to this person so your new love coming through here strongly an air time person to us capricorn but i kind of feel some of you here are very assertive you you're feeling the energy coming through here is that of you like standing in your power like you don't care anymore you don't give a fuck anymore Whatever happens, happen. You're just out of the whole shit, okay? You're not babying anyone, okay? You are not working on eggshells with anyone. You're saying it as it is. You're defending yourself. Some of you heavily in defense mode here. And I also see that some of you are heavily confused as to what to do with this particular relationship. One minute you're giving up and the next minute you still want to fight for this connection. All right, my dear Lord, this is all I have for you. If this resonates, please don't forget to like, subscribe. Um, personal reading, personal guidance, information for that will be in the description box. And I will see you in my next video. Bye and thank you.